Hello everyone, and welcome to another devlog for our game, Alpaca Rancher. In this devlog, we will be checking in on the progress we've made over the past few weeks. Our focus has mainly been reworking and polishing existing systems, as well as fleshing out the pieces of the world. For starters, we added detail to the border trees and created a tile set for each biome. We might still add more detail to these trees later, but for now we're proud of how they turned out. We also worked to create a cliff set for each biome. Originally, the cliffs were large pieces of art made to cover several ground tiles. After working with this model for a while, we realized it would be better to have smaller tile set pieces made on a 256 by 256 canvas. These tiles are easier to build with and look much cleaner. Next, we worked to improve upon the interaction system. Before, we had a single type of interaction that handled the foraging, mining, cutting of trees, etc. But this was quickly becoming bloated. Realizing this, we split all of these out into their own separate interactions. This adds a bit more code, but also allows for much more detail in the interactions. Next, we work to create the resource gathering systems. I revamped the grasslands tree so it was more in line with the style for the other trees. I also work to break the tree into a stump and top piece so we can play an animation when they're cut down. James also worked to create a gathering mini game that will activate when chopping wood or mining. This is currently placeholder UI for the game. When chopping wood or mining, the player will need to click the button when the cursor is inside the activation area. Back on the farm, we worked on the pen upgrade system and designed the art for pen upgrades 1, 2, and 3. We began work on the quest systems and created a rough draft of the UI. We want the player to obtain quests through NPC interactions or through a town message board. The player will then be able to track and manage their quests throughout the main journal UI. This system is still a work in progress. Next, we worked on the teleport slash transition system. We plan to use this for rabbit hole areas, such as caves. We also may implement fast travel spots in the future. We also began scoping the town area for the grasslands. I created three NPCs. We plan to have more later after fleshing out the town design more. I also created a few items of scatter, such as a well and a town message board. As always, thank you for watching and following along with the development of Alpaca Rancher. Please leave a like if you enjoyed the video and consider subscribing so you will be notified when we release more. If you are interested in Alpaca Rancher, you can help us out by wishlisting Alpaca Rancher on Steam. Links are in the description.